We are still very far away from a lot of food and industry stuff here. And so I decided that this edge grant could bring something a little bit cheaper to our students. 19, 19 and 20. A tip. I'll take tips. Right now we do have hot and cold coffee and that's just the basic start of this, just to get something going for our students to kind of know a routine. Eventually we're going to turn this into teas, potentially going to be anything from smoothies and just knowing that like whether kids, you know, I think they enjoy coffee, whether it is hot and cold. They like a lot of creamers, they like a lot of that kind of stuff. So I think even with the seasons and stuff like that, I think coffee itself is just something kids just really like to have in their hands. Knowing that our school store was moving from the cafeteria up to the second floor to not have to go against federal laws or be able to compete with the actual cafeterias, we thought a store with snacks eventually, but also the coffee shop for sure. This is my marketing class. So they are the ones that sign up for this in each time in the enrollment, marketing or marketing link application. And it's an opportunity for them to do something in the school and it's also offered as dual credit through WSU Tech. Right now we have it during lunch because that's a time where my students will actually be here. For nine years I've had this be anything from a school store to a photo booth industry and then even apparel. Shanna and I are very good friends. I know she's done something like this before. I even told her, I was like, I really think it's a good idea. It's something cheap enough, easy enough to make it two into something. Because again, students really like the taste of creamers, the taste of that stuff. And so making something available for them, you know, it's very possible to keep trying to grow this. And like I said, other opportunities for my students to say, what could we do next? And that's kind of the idea is it needs to be for more of the students keep promoting and keep putting the money into the students itself as well. Are we going to use cards? Of course you can. All of the money and proceeds is going right back into the school store, whether it's actually going to fund a lot of the foods that are eventually going to come, um, any of the things that we need to keep updating here, like in decorations or our coffee. But really, we want to give right back into the apparel. We've had that apparel. I know people ask for the apparel. It is just very expensive, and so knowing that if there's some consistent profit coming in right away, we know that we can put that into the inventory and try to grow that. Easy to say that we've had a line out of the room, but we've already made enough to be able to pay the first bill that we had. And so it was just, just word of mouth, even just a little bit of our social media that we've used to kind of get kids in here, even a few of our teachers. It's just kind of just been that word of mouth because I want my students to grow the actual part of promotion itself.